Hello and uh, welcome to my channel. I'm the Frog Queen. I'm a Minecraft streamer and content creator and today I'm doing something a little different. I am going to be showing you how to remove follows from your Twitch account, which you'll probably have to do if you get follow botted. <laughs> I only first got follow botted on my last stream which was two days ago and I was speaking to a lot of my other uh, friends who stream and they told me they also got hit within the last few days and a lot of us didn't know what to do so I had known about this tool called uh, commander root and I didn't know how to use it so I thought I would share that information with you because it is a very powerful tool it's created by a twitch uh, employee and it actually can it does have the power to remove every follower on your list so let's take a look so that you don't have any anxiety about it as I did um, it's really easy to use pretty straightforward but there are a few key things you're going to want to keep in mind uh, before you go and try to use it so let's start with um, just the basics on what to do if you do get follow botted my suggestion is if you get follow botted while you're streaming remain calm just take down or note the time uh, for me, it was 6.33, so I wrote that down immediately, and then I noted the first follower name. That's not a real big deal, but it's just nice to kind of have to reference for when you go to use this, but you don't have to take that down. If it all happens too fast for you, don't worry about it. Um, also, tell your mods this information so that they can back you up, that they can write it down when it happens as well, and then you'll have that to go back on as well to double check and verify everything. So my suggestion is continue streaming. Just turn off alerts, take a moment, say, hey guys, we just got follow botted. I'm just gonna turn off my alerts. Go into um, your stream elements or stream labs and disable your follower notifications, your follower alerts. If you can't do that, just turn them all off in OBS. That's perfectly fine too. And uh, that'll take care of the sounds. Now, depending on how many follow bots are following you uh, that could depend on whether or not you can turn your alerts right back on again or not I got follow botted with 150 and I thought it was actually a lot less than that because it seemed to go by very quickly on um, that being said um, a lot of my friends got follow botted with like 2k followers like that and that can really ruin a streams uh, alerts so then you have to be if you're going to continue streaming which I suggest you do um, then during that stream um, then what I suggest is simply paying a little bit more attention get your mods to help you out so that you can be your own alert bot I suppose <laughs> and you're just gonna have to thank people um, a little bit more conscientiously and pay attention to your activity feed now that could be a very difficult thing depending on you know how many followers you do have how big your chat is um, my chat currently is around you know a hundred a hundred chatters give or take on any random day and it can go up a lot higher than that. And then it can be very difficult to take care of everything going on in your activity feed all by yourself, but just do your best. What I want to stress is don't, don't stop your stream just because you got follow botted. Um, that's what they want you to do. They want to overwhelm you and you wanna not let them win. <laughs> just keep going. All right, so let's take a look at Commander Root here. So uh, this is Twitch Tools by Commander Root which is, that's, that's person, I guess. You can follow him on Twitter as well. Don't mind me, it's morning for me. I'm gonna, I'm gonna be drinking my green tea. So um, this tool lets you remove followers from your Twitch account. So you got up here, you got emote content ID, uh, follower list viewer. There's all these little other tools up here but we're using the follower remover. I'll put the link in the description of this video so that you can use this whenever you need to. So you can filter followers by date, account creation, time between account creation, and follow and username. So this is the big thing that we're gonna be doing and this is what I suggest you do when you get follow botted. That's why you wanna take down the date, the time that it happened, and maybe the first username and last username if you can, but mostly it's the, the dates that you're gonna be concerned about. So this says, it is a very powerful, it is very powerful and can if wanted clear your follower list completely. So that's kind of your warning. So don't go doing anything rash. So let's log into Twitch. 
here I go populating it's loading my followers for me and here we go so it goes followed at so you're gonna pick the day I, I've already removed my follow bot so I should have done this on video for you but I'm just gonna show you anyways right here you're gonna pick the day that you were follow botted and that's um, the end this is so in between so I, if you're followed better on the same day, you're going to pick the same day. Make sure you get the year right, of course. That's crucial because if you pick the wrong year, you're going to be removing a lot more, a lot more follows than you intended to. And then here you go. You're going to pick the hour right next to it. And then you can change this. Just plug in, you know, exactly the hour. And it is in military time. So you go down this. It's going to also note the time that you see so your time zone so if you have mods in a different time zone and they take down a different time remember to convert that to your time zone okay so that's easy 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 um, and then you're just gonna go apply filters so let's just go apply filters of course there's no followers found using this filter for me because there just there just wasn't any followers during that time but if you do have followers it's going to tell you how many followers were during that time so you'll know exactly how many followers you're follow botted with and it'll list them in this empty space below here um, and then that's when you're going to go and just verify that you think you got them all just between this time and this time if you want to be very absolutely sure that you're not including any real follows during that time um, you can just adjust the time frame a little on the end just in case um, but I mean real followers if you get happen to get a few in that time they're going to come back and when somebody drops a follow bot on you all those followers drop on you within like a few minutes generally so you're not going to be looking at a giant space of time for the follows to be filtering through that's one thing that i've noticed generally i know that there are different ones that can filter through slower but for the most part you're looking at maybe you know one to five minutes tops that you're going to be deleting followers from so anyone who's followed you after that that time um it is going to remain as long as that you've chosen the correct um times here to filter out and then you're going to go remove all followers listed below. You've also got this cool option where you can export it as a CSV file, which I like, which might be good if you're like regularly getting follow botted and harassed. And then you can kind of take a look at some of the names. Um, this tool can also be used to block and target specific names. So if you see here usernames, if somebody's, you know, creating accounts to kind of harass you through, you can go in and, and, and block them and everything through this as well which is really nice um, you can also use this to uh, block people who are creating accounts that are very small uh, so it's the minutes between account creation and follow so if someone's creating an account and that account is following you to harass you right away you can exclude these using this tool as well so there's a lot you can do with this to kind of cut down on some of the harassment that you might be experiencing as a streamer um, which makes this an amazing tool and so when you go to click remove all followers listed below and there's a little drop down here you can just remove them or you can block those same users from refollowing which is nice so if you are concerned that you're going to be blocking real follows like actual people then you can just go just remove followers and hope that those people will come back and follow you again which they probably will you know because uh, they love you because you're because you're awesome <laughs> so remove followers and block them from refollowing is what you do if you're absolutely sure that it's just follow bots which in my case it was so that's what I did um, and then once you hit that button it will come up here and ask you to reconfirm it so you have several chances to make sure that you've entered the right time and that you're not actually blocking anybody that is a real follower which is excellent and that's really all there is to it it's it's not difficult um, it's important though to remember just to remain calm while you're on stream um, the reasons that people decide to follow bot 
uh, a streamer there's there could be many reasons one of them is that um it's malicious it's they're doing it to disrupt your stream so that you stop streaming usually um uh, or just to see you get upset um so it's important to remain calm and and not worry about it it's easy to take care of it just takes a few extra steps um and it does kind of suck when you have to turn off your alerts for a long period of time during a stream but your viewers are going to understand the other reasons that sometimes people uh, follow bought you is because they actually genuinely think that they're helping by giving you a bunch of follows <laughs> which is not true if you get like a lot of followers um very quickly twitch might think that you are purposely trying to grow your stream in this um this false way make your you know make yourself look like you're much more inflated than you are um which could be a problem twitch really doesn't seem to care that much about followers um because it really doesn't seem to impact partner decisions very much and it also uh they don't care about doing anything to help people who get follow botted by like say 20k followers uh, so the fact that they don't really care <laughs> means that you're probably not going to get in trouble for it. Um, but it is best to just clear that stuff out just in case because you don't want um, Twitch to actually think that you're doing this um, on purpose. So definitely use Commander Root. It works. It's easy. It's going to be your best friend if you are a serious streamer, a career streamer, or anything like that. If you aspire to be a career streamer, this is what you're going to need to use. Anyways, if you like this video, guys, um, and you want to see more content like this, give me a thumbs up. But please go check out my Patreon. My Patreon is pretty much exclusively streaming tips and tutorials on how to use things like stream elements and stream labs and obs and things like that so if you do like this content you know definitely go over there and support me on patreon it's pretty cheap <laughs> and uh, i'm very active on patreon i like to talk to all my patreons of course also i do spend a lot of time with my community on the discord so feel free to join my discord and of course watch me stream live on twitch <laughs> anyways guys i'm the frog queen thank you so much and uh until next time keep mining keep crafting keep creating and don't let follow bots stop you from streaming <laughs> okay bye <laughs>